Hey guys, it's Fury91, and I'm talking about Google Stadia. Apparently, there was a poll done in the UK, France, Germany, and Spain, and apparently only 15% of people are actually interested in cloud gaming, at least like a, what they call a Netflix-like gaming service, right? And I could see that because on the Inside Gaming video, they were talking about how it may be latency, right? But I don't think latency... Yes, latency is a big deal because... Gamers don't like latency. Let's face it, we, we play online games when you have sometimes the smallest amount of latency can cause you to either win or lose a fight. So it makes sense, but I don't think that's it. I think the problem is that they're not going full throttle Netflix into this because like Game Pass, where you have to just pay a fee and then you get all the games, you don't have to pay for the games by themselves, that how a Netflix service for gaming should work. You can't, in my opinion, bring out Google Stadia, have people pay $9.99 a month get some games and then have to pay full price for the big ones like Assassin's Creed Odyssey and and other games that are probably going to still be full price. I mean, I just don't see the appeal because if you're going to go Netflix, to quote Yoda, either do or do not, you got to go full throttle. You cannot just come up with this halfway Netflix where it's like, okay, we're going to be where you pay a monthly fee and that monthly fee will get you some games and then you're going to have to still pay full price for the other games and you're not even downloading them. If, if you can buy access to these games and then all of a sudden, like, let's just say if Google Stadia completely flops, what happens then? Do you have, still have your Google Stadia games? I mean, it's a streaming service. And that's the problem that I think some people have. People like to own their games. They like to know that even if something happens to the company, like, if you own a Dreamcast and when Sega went down, you could still play your Dreamcast games. Yes, if any games are online, you can play them online, but at least you could still play them. So to me, it, this just makes sense. It makes sense that a lot of people aren't interested right now. And I think it's more than just the latency. I really think that people want a Netflix service. They don't want you to be like almost Netflix or like halfway Netflix. They want you to be an actual full-blown Netflix service where it's just going to be a monthly fee and you get access to all the games. But what do you guys think about this? Are you guys interested in cloud gaming and Google Stadia in general? Let me know in the comments below. Thanks for watching. Remember to like, share, and subscribe. May God bless you all.